If you've experienced any first responder funeral or parade, you've probably heard the somber sound of bagpipes. It's a tradition that spans more than 170 years, beginning when most police and firefighters in New York City were Irish. Today, first responders of all backgrounds make up bands across the country. Reporter Lauren Korn introduces us to one band bringing the tradition to South Carolina. Irish band, five, six, eight, quick, march. It's the soulful sound of the bagpipes, entwined with the beating of the drums, that gives these men and women one more reason to be proud to bleed red and blue. It's a wonderful group of people. We're a, a service band, which means that made up mostly of fire and police. Firefighter Janine Shelley joined the Coastal Carolina Shields Pipes and Drums Band in November, playing pipes for the last 15 years. I, I just love it. it. It's a passion of mine. It's a lifetime of learning. They say there's only nine notes to it, but there's a million embellishments that go with it. So <laughs> the minute you slack off, you kind of fall backwards. So you got to keep practicing and, and uh, to make it work for sure. Just ask Officer Danny Sullivan, the support services trainer for Myrtle Beach Police. I've been with the band since 2015. Um, I'm proud to say I'm their first student. So they got me from student to streets. And uh, now I am a pipe corporal for the band. Danny played in New York before joining the more than 20-person crew, making sure all the pipers are in tune. The band not only keeps their instruments in tune, but also their steps. Ready at a moment's notice to honor the fallen and their families, or perform at parades, celebrations, and graduations. We're a fun band. We'd like to go out and just have a good time. We do like going out and playing the social events, but more importantly, we like to do the ceremonies and, and continue that tradition. A tradition that retired Yonkers police officer Bob Brown brought to Myrtle Beach. It's become such a tradition with the police department, I just thought it'd be something nice to bring down here. Brown is the pipe major, decked out in the four stripes that shows he's the one in charge of picking the music. It's not an easy hobby, but it's, uh, it's you know, fulfilling, you know, especially like I said, with the you know, part of our heritage and all. The Shields Pipes and Drums Band is nothing new, rather steeped in first responder history, including the kilt they wear, an ancient Brody hunting tartan. Been going on since over 200 years and big presence up, especially since I know from New York. They say that the pipes came over with uh, immigrants when they came to New York City from Ireland and Scotland. A very popular during times of uh, like line of duty deaths is when you would hear the pipes play. Besides providing music, the service band also raises money for charities. And, you know, fundraisers, toy drives, things like that. And say they're always looking for their next member. We'll teach people. We have, uh, you know, a couple of the old guys can't march anymore. They do the teaching. You enjoy music, you enjoy the brotherhood, come out. You know, join the band. It's just a good organization and it's a good way to give back to your community.